There is a sweet anointed in the sanctuary. There is a stillness in the atmosphere. Come and lay down. The burdens you have carried For in the sanctuary God is here Hey guys, welcome to the first official episode of Sanctified with Rochelle So, um this is supposed to be um a podcast slash youtube channel basically where i share my spiritual journey and um my christian walk with god and it's i wanted the slogan to be like growing deeper with god because literally that's what i want to do especially like for 2023 is to grow deeper with my relationship with god so late last year in 2022 um God has been speaking to me very loudly. <laughs> he has been telling me to start a podcast or start a channel where I could basically tell people of his word. Now, he started telling me this like around October, November, and I wrote it down and I just kept coming up with a bunch of excuse as to why I can't start it. Like I was like, oh, I don't have the equipment yet. I don't have um, a name for it yet. I don't think that I know as much to like lead people into the promised land. And one of the things um, that I've actually learned is that I don't need to know everything. Like the whole point of this, 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 this YouTube channel is for me to like show you how I am growing as a Christian and growing, growing closer to God and just, you know, being as um, vulnerable and open as possible. And um, I was actually watching a sermon yesterday. Um, it's called Launch with Victory. And it was, I think I, it was Pastor Michael Todd. And he was talking about, you know, how a lot of us, like as soon as he started the sermon, like as he was talking about how a lot of us, you know, we we know what God wants us to do and we have been sitting down and making excuses and basically like, you know, not doing what he wants us to do and not being obedient. And um, that literally woke me up. So I was like, you know what? Like, um, I might not know everything, but I am trying to and I'm, I am and I am trying to learn. and I am trying to be a, as, you know, what God has called me to be. And that's why we're here today. So um, this is just a podcast. I think it's going to be a podcast It's gonna or it's going to be a YouTube channel. I don't know. Um, I just wanted to start, you know, I just wanted to be obedient to God. I wanted to, I, I, I know like there's so many things that I have to learn, but um, God does not call the qualified. He qualifies the, the unqualified and he can use anyone. And um, he's chosen me to be a vessel for persons who have basically like lost their way as it pertains to like Christ. Now, why I said that is because um, I'm going to give you like a backstory of who I am and, you know, my my Christian life with God. So I got baptized when I was like 13 years old. Um, I I think I was in grade eight at the time. And the only reason why I got baptized was solely because everybody in my church that was around my age was getting baptized. Like I did not know what it what it mean what it means to be a Christian. I did not um, have a relationship with God. I genuinely did not know what I was getting myself into. And um, I'm I have never like in all of my Christian work, I've never literally had a relationship with God. And it's literally one of my biggest regrets of my life because having a relationship with him, like being in depth with him and just like communicating with him and him communicating with me, it's just like, wow, like I could have literally experienced this from like ever since I was 13. So um, I, I was in school. I was um I was a part of all the Christian things. I was a part of the IFCF. Like it was a Christian Christian like fellowship in um at my high school and I went to church every single Sunday. I was on every committee. I was very active in church and I just was everywhere when it comes on to like being with God, but I never genuinely had a relationship with him. It is so embarrassing to say that like 
I've been a Christian like ever since I was 13 but it wasn't until like last year like late last year where I actually like took the bible up and read it and I have to give like a huge shout out to um pastor Michael Todd because God used him to to um to bring me back to him and he's been using me he's been using him to to be grow deeper with him um how is it was when I actually found him on TikTok there's this like one minute message that he was like preaching and I was like wow like this really touched my heart <laughs> and I went on YouTube and I googled the message and the first message I saw was actually on TBN and it was like 30 or 40 minutes I I think it was like 30 minutes and I remember like I was watching it and in, like the way how it ended like it felt like there was more so I went and I looked for um for Michael Todd and I saw Transformation Church and I watched the entire message in its entirety and I was like wow like this is really like this is literally what God's been trying to tell me and I've been binge watching sermons like his sermons for like so long and I've been watching like Jerry Flowers and just like anybody that you know um that can like let me grow closer to God and it's so crazy that you know God used him and he's been telling me to, to to try to be a vessel to other people as well um that's something that i've never thought um i could do that's actually one of my biggest thing that i was really afraid of when i was younger i never thought that i could bring people to god because i didn't think i knew anything all i knew was um was like the little bible verses that like they would teach you when you went to sunday school or if you went to if you went to like school like i never knew anything about the bible i didn't know how to encourage people i didn't know how to like you know speak with to, 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 to um to to seek wisdom from god like i genuinely did not know what it meant to like be a christian and um it's crazy because like everywhere i would go people would always assume that i was a christian like i would go to a function like and people the first thing they'll be like oh my god are you a christian and i'll be like yeah how do you know that they're like oh you just like seem like a christian i'm like really and literally like every workplace i've went to there's not a workplace that i've ever gone and like nobody and like somebody hasn't like asked me if i was that so like it's like his favor was on my life and it's like something that i have i should have been doing like to the best of my ability my entire life but it took for, like for like michael todd to like bring me in and to like truly get to know god and honestly um it has been so amazing so um this first episode um i was gonna do like you know um like steps of how to like get closer to god but i think i'm gonna like say that for the next video because like i think i was been i've been babbling in this one um but i do hope you guys come along with me on this journey i think we can both learn something you know you can encourage me i can encourage you and um we can grow closer and deeper together with god so um <laughs> this is basically the first episode and i do hope you guys stay tuned um i do hope we can um fellowship together one day so have a good one guys bye